attack! The battle cry comes from Rapunzel as she races out of Fairy Tale Reform School with dozens of students on her heels. The day I turned 12, I was certain it'd be my favorite birthday yet. But then I got the letter. When the Windy Bottom Town Council voted to tear down the old playground and build a new one, no one ever imagined what lay buried beneath the rusted slide. I'd rather dunk my head in a school toilet than run cross country. The exile of the Princess of Lakara didn't begin with swords or spells. It began inside the castle kitchen with a quest for cloves. It's harder to charm a chicken than you might think. Naked! Prince Charming is afraid of old ladies. Didn't know that, did you? Listen up, y'all. We're going to tell you the story of Calamity Jane. None of this would have happened if mom had just made macaroni and cheese for dinner. Bon appétit. Even the quietest voice can change the world. And so the very first sentence in this book is Mina was quiet. Chapter one, The Amazing Cupid, January 1st. Cupid has special powers. As soon as I'd written the words, I frowned. A big blot of ink had leaked from my pen and marred the very first page of my brand new journal. It's just breathing, I tell myself. It's easy. You do it every day. You just inhale, then exhale. Inhale, then <laughs> The vampire, whose fangs were too big for his mouth, turned to the camera and hissed. If someone had told me yesterday that I'd be spending my Saturday morning in the aisle of a stuffy bookstore searching for ghost stories, I would have told them they were nuts. My gym shorts burrow into my butt crack like a frightened groundhog. I wake to an urgent tap at my window. Oh my gosh, I just felt an urgent tap on my feet. What is it? What is it? Oh, oh my goodness, I think I see what just tapped me. It was a dog shark. Pretty much everything I do is inappropriate. Ugh. The weirdness in Bellwood all began with the smoke in the air and the ducks in Mr. Babbage's backyard. An actual clown conducted my mama's funeral. On the night before the funeral, Wonder Alice stopped believing in miracles. On the second to last day of sixth grade, I wake up to my parents snoring on the futon couch across the living room. The first thing Len noticed was the floor. And I'm here with my duplicate from a parallel universe, Earth-14, who insisted on reading the first line, so take it away. So this one time when I was six, I went sleepwalking and peed in my tub of Legos. relationship. They say the apple doesn't fall far from the tree, so I guess that makes me an orange. I'm nothing like my dad. Oh, hi. I'm sorry, I didn't see you there. I'm Jonathan Rosen, the world-famous author of Night of the Living Cuddle Bunnies, and today I'm going to read you the very first line. 
Like any good story worth telling, or bad one for that matter, mine starts in the mall. And scene. Thank you. I hope you enjoyed that. If you did, I'll be here all week. Like literally all week. I have nowhere else to go because of the virus. Thank you.